Hello, everybody! This is Obey 2 coming at you with my episode review of episode 7 of Brihilder in the Darkness. Now, this, again, was a very eventful episode, but it had a couple key parts that moved the story along pretty well, and I did some twists and turns that I did not see coming, which I really enjoyed. Now, this episode kicks off right where the last one ended, of course, with um, Ariotto talking to his uncle, who was working the lab, um, trying to break down the pill so they can reproduce it, so they'll have them for the witches. Now, unfortunately, he says, his uncle says, basically, at least it will take half a year to do. Unless the interior is crystallized, thus it can take possibly a month. And this sucks because they only have a month left of pills left. So, if they can't make it in a month, they're fucked. So, or they have to either break in somewhere and steal more pills, or they're fucked. So, I'm looking at this going, whoa, they're pretty screwed. And I was hoping for the best for them. I'm hoping for the best for them. They'll only take a month. But later in the episode, we find out that it's going to take at least half a year. So we're fucked. And so that's what this episode has. But also, we find out kind of by a rumor, just a rumor that Neko heard, why they made the witches to fight aliens. Yes, aliens, like the alien egg that they talked about in the capsule that Ryota showed his um, uncle, the amoeba alien. And if you go far enough back, they even had a flashback, which I loved, how uh, both Neko and Katori, they both said that they have met an alien. So... This comes, I did not see that coming. That really got me there. I did not see that coming. I really liked that. That was really interesting to me that we're not just going to have magic and witches and a, a rogue laboratory. We're going to have aliens. So that to me got really interesting and I got really thought that was like a cool twist to it that that's why they made these witches. But if they need these witches to um, uh, fight these aliens, why do they need to um, be so mean to them to make them want to run away and do all these things to control them just so they... I just don't get that very well. But the other part of the episode that they had later, we find out, is, um, is Ryota needs to go to Akibahara uh, to get... Um, to buy, pick up some stuff, and he ends up bringing Kazumi with him because she really wants to go and check it out, and they go to a maid cafe. The other thing that I thought was really cool in this episode, which happened a little earlier, sorry if folks, I'm jumping around a little, but the fact is that Neko finally goes out and does something. She goes karaoke with her friends, um, and Ryota kind of Tags follows her, he stalks her a little, because he's concerned about her. But the one thing we get out of this is, Nako asks a boy who's hitting on her, why, when I grab your hand, does my heart not race? Because when she grabs Ryota's, she says her heart races. So there's something going on there. If there's more than friendship, they could be getting, having a, building a relationship of course, anyone who watched it, spoiler alert, um, we do know Neko is Ryota's um, lost childhood friend, so there is that there that could be it, even though she doesn't remember being his childhood friend. So I'm kind of interested with these little elements going on in this episode, what's going to happen in the next one, um, what the character development's going to be, what's going to go on with this pill, uh, how are they going to get more? Because it, it, I don't see them dying off after a month. Um, so I'm really interested. Plus, what's going up with this alien crap? So I'm really interested in what's happening with the aliens, how they're going to move past this month left of pills, and um, 
the character building between Ryota, Kana, Katori, Kazumi, Kazumi, and Neko, of course. I really want to see that. Thus, this is the old boy 82 thing. If you like this video, please click like. If you want to see more, please subscribe. This is your boy 82 setting out.